what's going on everyone day 28 horde night now since uh the last time that i checked in i've done a little bit more work a lot of more reconstruction and i think for defense wise this is a setup that i'm gonna go with now it's just a slight little moat nothing too deep uh, i do need to plan and still break out all this uh asphalt down the road I might flatten it out, you know, things of that nature, but really it's just more or less something to damage them if uh, I get a random horde here. Because like I said, this ain't really a location that I'm going to do a, a horde night. Then as far as the facility goes, you know, I actually came back down, uh, did more work down here. Uh, cleared out all the water. Now, yeah, so this, you know, this will be all under construction at some point. All that good stuff. But I just wanted to make some kind of progress. And then as far as the uh, outer wall, as you can see, I actually brought it in. And the two drawbridges that I made, you know, I'm going to have one here. And then one on the opposite end. Yeah, I really didn't like the fact of it being all the way out here. That was just too much damn uh, space. Now, I will say I am a little bit concerned about Horde Knight. Obviously, because <laughs> uh, the last thing I need is for them to spawn over here. But we come up here and you can see, you know, worked out a little bit more. Of course, I'm going to need a lot of Crescentium. So I pretty much planted, I think, uh, 30 or 40 uh, seeds over there. So hopefully I get some more. Now, man, like I said, I've just been digging out, getting everything, uh, just putting in the grind. Then I even went back and removed the middle layer. Well, just the outside, just to put the black strip in there. Just to give it a little bit more visual pop. And same as the pillars. I just haven't got around to do the backside yet. But overall, it's coming along, and I'm pretty happy with it. So, let's see. Then, as far as over here, obviously... I just added more spikes, replaced the ones that were damaged, uh, and I don't know. I am really, really concerned right now about being over here. You know, even though I did put a bedroll in there, I actually stuck it on the windowsill, I believe. Yeah, it's like right there on the, the window. Uh, I don't know. I have a feeling that they can still spawn in there. So if they spawn from the west, I am going to have to leave the damn base and draw them away. So this might be one of those days where, <laughs> uh, I'm spinning it all out here. So as a precaution, I took all the 9mm rounds that I had, which is 454. I'm carrying 1,500 7.62 rounds. I'm actually currently making more. Uh, let's see. Oh, my concrete's done. Now I'm just trying to get a stockpile of everything as best as humanly possible. And you can see I've tried to do full production now on, uh, on concrete. There we go. Ah, the infamous Blood Moon. Ah, let me double check everything, make sure I am good to go on everything. You know what? Just in case I do have to take it to the ground, I'd be better off uh, doing that. And yeah, and I 
I did get a second treasure map, so I'm hoping to get at least another one or two. Maybe with Horde Knight, I'll have some luck, especially after all the cops. And the last Samara that actually spawned over here, uh, she actually brought me in a cop. Of course, he didn't have shit when I killed him, but... Hey, you know what? I'll take it. Because eventually she'll be calling in ferals as, as well. But I wanted to bring some materials over here because I didn't really fix anything. I'm trying to think, where was it the last time? I think they were... A little bit obsessive over here in the corner. Yeah, and I mean, they, look at that. They really didn't do nothing, even though they hugged it. Just something to, just to cover my ass, because I don't really also want this to bust open. Looked like there was one that was uh, a lot more damaged. Yep. Okay, cool. <sighs> I put this here so I can put that there. So as you can see, I brought some stuff. Uh, I do have a cop of attitude. And then I got six for dog day, so I'm definitely reading those. Yeah, that looks sick. Fuck, I love building. But of course, at the same time, it's terrifying me, like I said, because... Man, if they spawn over there, uh, it's going to be a bad, bad day. You know, my only option is to haul ass down one of these roads and fight everything you know, out in the open. So let's make sure everything is loaded just in case. All right. Come on up for the shits and giggles. And I'm actually going to sit here and stare at this way. Ooh, is it... Man. It just looks really, really creepy. Of course, that has a lot of work. I am going to turn that into... The more I thought about it, the top floor is going to be a residential sector. You know, for my scientists and everything, because this is a facility. Uh, it's not a permanent residence, but it is... Uh, a facility nonetheless, and scientists and all them will be working here. Now, try to gain more valuable knowledge on the zombie apocalypse. But then, trying to also figure out what I'm going to do with the farm, the forge still, all that good shit. Uh, and it's it's definitely a, a clusterfuck, if, I, if I'm being honest. Uh, to be honest, I've actually drove back down here to my clay pit that I had dug out. And I'm almost tempted to try to convert that into my farm. You know, it's a little bit of a distance away, but not too far. And it's still close enough to where I can hit it with ease. You know, and it's almost about the same distance both ways if I build that castle up here. So it's not too, too bad. Oh, shit. Here we go. So this might be, uh... <laughs> this might be a very, very interesting uh, horde night. Okay, they're coming in from the north. Now, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna have to do something... Uh, before next Horde Night. Oh, shit. I meant to read these. And... 11.52. So, let's just, uh... Get these little puppies out of here. Of course, it would be nice if I actually got some damn decent shit this time. Hi, Ash. You know what? I'm right here. I'll take the coffee. Why not? 
take all that bullshit. There you go, buddy. There you go. Whoa. Damn, there are a bus of those now. Uh, that's pretty impressive, Cindy. Jared, calm down. And thankfully, uh, I did manage to get my uh, rifle skills up to 40. So I raised that rank. But now I think I uh, I will be saving my skill points so I can unlock the workbench and the chem station. Now, even though I can find more than enough, I still like having the option to be able to build them. There you go. Oh, finally. There you go, buddy. Ash, how you doing? There you go. There you go. Uh, cop your shit. Yeah. Cindy, Ash, bitch. I mean, you know what? If I'm going to have that many, we'll just uh, keep on reading them because the more skill points, the better. Yeah, I'm up to 17 now. Sylvia? You think you're going? I guess that's a byproduct of uh, the toothy being so small. Uh huh. Yeah. Fuck your head. Block that, jackass. Sit down, Ash. And how you doing, Shrieker? Actually, I needed that sweater. Ash? Calm your shit, Karen. Hey, Sylvia, and another Mike. Y'all are pretty popular lately. Oh, Steve. You do me a favor and get the fuck out of my way. Blood bag. Oh, hi, Ed. Bye, Ed. Ah, the power couple. Ah, no. Ah, no. Oh. Uh, I don't really give a shit about the tank top. Ah, cowboy hat. Cindy, calm down. Oh, okay, okay. Everybody calm down. Everybody gets a group hug. Of course, I hug with my spike club. 
and there you go, and there you go. Uh, that's a lot of ashes. And of course you guys ain't got shit. Damn. Seems like they're faster. Maybe it's just me. Uh, obviously I don't want that bullshit. Uh, but I do need those. Uh, I kind of need some dogs, guys. I didn't even get a damn dog day. <laughs> Speaking of puppies, I'm out. How you doing, Tweaker? More duct tape. Ah, no, you swing somewhere else, bitch. There you go. Check ass. Damn, look at the tank tops. Steve. Everybody chill for a second. Uh, Cindy. Bitch. You know what's gonna happen, Cindy. Oh, a little stubbiness. Look at that. There you go. Calm your loins. Got Mike, Steve, Ash, Steve, asshole. Oh, cool. Hey, you know what? I'll hang on to that. Now, what's up? Uh, oh, thank you very much. Oh, wait, Stefan. Shit, I already got two maps rolling. Damn. Uh, fuck. Oh. the uh there you go there you go puppy although honestly I don't know why I read the top challenge oh damn <laughs> you didn't need that, did you? Uh, is that done? Oh, no. There you go. Of course, I won't read another one unless I see some dogs. Haha, <laughs> 
bitch. Hey, speaking of puppies. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I think I just need one more dog now. Sid. Yeah. Fuck you swinging at. Alright, some more good shit. What did you think was going to happen? Alright, can't make it. Shut up. Clean this up. I knew I'd be too damn close. Damn. Oh, fuck off, Sylvia. Damn. Give me a damn minute. I'm not too worried if I spend all the 9 mil. Obviously. That's not good. They're piling up way too damn quick. Good to see you. Love ass. Don't look so surprised, Karen. What the hell did you think was gonna happen? Fuck you, thick. Good God. Whoa. Oh. Ash. Fuck off already. And you didn't even have anything worth a damn. Yeah, jackass making all that noise. Ah. Uh.
Yeah, yeah. Damn. The carnage is real. Fuck you, then. As soon as I kill one, I guess I can't really be arguing, but damn. Fuck off, Steve. Ed. Tell you right now, I'm tired of your shit, too. I really should be trying to get those bones, though. Yeah, just, just hang around a little bit, Nick. Ah, Cindy. No. There you go. Yeah, you are a persistent bitch. The <laughs> fucking city. <laughs> uh, oh, what? You don't like that? Too bad, Ed. Damn! And of course, all you bring is sandwiches. Cause you're an asshole. Some brass is good. Don't think so. Don't think so. Ah. Come on. Ah, oh, hi, puppy. Uh. You know what? Quit chewing on the fucking face! Cindy, you're adorable. And you're legless. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Holy hell. No one gives a shit, Ed. Where the fuck was you at? Damn. Ah. 
up. This is bad. They spawn way too fast. Bitch, kneel! Uh, I gotta put some spikes on that corner. I don't know why I said it. it's so so much of a fucking bullet sponge. Fucking mutt! Alright, where you at? Where you at, you fucking mutt? I hear you. Motherfucker! Holy shit! Jesus Christ! Fucking shit. Fucking die already. Oh, fuck you, Sid. Alright, where'd you. Where you going, you little fucker? Fucking bullet sponge like no tomorrow. And they don't even give you fucking shit. Take a fucking hit. Fucking prick. How the fuck are you still alive? You know what? I'm done fucking with y'all. Oh, fuck you. Only fucking ways. Only way to raise your fucking armor skill, you gotta take fucking hits, and then you get fucking punished for it. What? Fuck this shit. Fucking done with it. Come here. I don't care if I'm on fire. Am 
on, now you motherfuckers all want it to fucking keep coming. Bunch of fucking pussies. Come on! Oh, yeah, now none of you motherfuckers want to come. Yeah, that's what I fucking thought. I see you sneaking in the fucking grass. Bunch of bitches. Yeah, like magic, huh? <laughs> Fuck off. And paper. Fucking useless. Well, hell. Yeah. Come outside the base. And they all fucking run away. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda mad. Not one cop? <laughs> hmm. Nice. Uh, actually, I don't give a shit about that. Hmm. <laughs> that's that's actually pretty damn. Yeah, Cindy, that's fucking bullshit. Put that away, I guess. Well, I mean... <sighs> now there's a crawler out there somewhere. Hmm. Yeah. Step outside of the base and all you motherfuckers run away like a little bitch. Anything to say for yourself, Cindy? Hmm? Nothing? Yeah. That's what I thought. For fuck's sake, come on. There we go. <sighs> yeah, I mean, did I really think wooden spikes would last long? No. Shut up. I need to keep your damn moldy bread. Wow. Wow. Yeah, you fuckers know. Oh, oh, of course, Ed would be the one. What the fuck? Fuck off. I swear the hitbox sometimes is just fucking straight out trash. Yeah, like that missed. Idiot. Oh! Alright. I now have a full set of uh, hazmat gear. Not the best in the world, but... Pants was all I needed. <laughs> and 
anybody else. <sighs> I didn't even brought my crossbow. Didn't even use it. Yeah, how'd that work out for you? Another treasure map! Finally, some good shit! Uh-huh. How'd that work out for you? Oh, I will take those rounds, thank you very much. Yeah, step into my office. Yeah, I really should have been saving those bones. But, piss on it. Oh, hi, Mike. Well, you are persistent. Hmm. And don't care about that. Ah, oh. Bullet sponge. Shove that up your ass. The fuck's up with nails? I literally made a thousand nails a few days back. And now everyone's fucking carrying nails. Ah. Sorry, Karen. Wow. I actually got a pistol. I am, uh, impressed. Let's go ahead and repair that. Go ahead and repair that. Oh, it is morning. Well, hell. And not one cop. I'm actually really disappointed in that because, you know, I went to Horde. No, not Horde. Went to Hub City, got 13 cops. Samara even summoned a cop. Probably because I damn read the challenge. Okay, well. Huh. This is kind of a first. Because I don't have shit to clean up. Although that actually pisses me off right there. So, actually what I'm going to do... Punch a little bit of this grass real quick. Yeah, I'll get to you in a minute, Cindy. Chill. Okay, so, strange enough, <laughs> uh, I don't have to sort anything. I don't have to break from anything. Now, loot-wise, let's see. Uh, that's definitely a good thing, since I've lost the fucking wellness. And then when I go inside and eat a meat stew, I'm guaranteed to raise my wellness. But the hazmat pants, obviously a good thing. Uh, even though I already have a set of Stefan's uh, treasure maps, I'm pretty sure uh, I could definitely use that. I needed a new blue sweater, so that's actually uh, a nice addition. The pistol will definitely come in handy. Uh, any commentary, Cindy? Yeah! Yeah, I guess she had some commentary, but she didn't want to say it. But with more treasure maps in hand... Hmm. I am actually tempted now uh, to spend either today or tomorrow and actually go after these treasure maps. Because I need Dukes desperately. Of course, I also need... Uh, 
figure this out, work on this. I also need to work on a horde base. I also need to work on a forge. Oh. All the shit. Uh, let's see. So, treasure maps. Yeah. But that works. I can read three treasure maps, go after three chests, come back, read another three. That's six total treasure maps. Uh, or treasure chests, I should say. And yes. <laughs> Started saving schematics. But for my library this time around, I'm only going to do one schematic of every of each one. And I think I started trying to say something earlier and I forgot. I don't have the auger schematic. So, um, yeah. That's one of the things I need to keep in mind when I go to a, a trader. God, I love the atmosphere. But it makes you wonder why sometimes you get lightning and sometimes you don't. Or not lightning, but thunder. Yeah. And then with those trees out of the way, you know, I'm getting more natural light. So I think that might be what I do today. Yeah, treasure chest. That sounds actually like a lot of fun. Of course, I won't bore you with me going through the whole thing. Uh, obviously, I'll show when I open the chest probably next time I come back. Uh, but I might do that with the treasure. Uh, what day was it? Was it day 26? Yeah, tr traders have reset. So I might go ahead and do the treasure chest. Try to make some dukes. Uh, maybe when I come back, I'll take a trip to the traders. See if we can do uh, even more beneficial stuff. Uh, as a result of that. And I need to keep on working on my base, obviously. Because she's coming along, but still got a lot of work involved. At the same time, I really want to travel. Yeah, you know, that four-way down here in the south is uh, very promising. Yeah, it's very promising, Cindy. Put your bitch in. But, of course, my hoarder looter side is just itching to go north. Because that town up there. <sighs> just way too much shit to do. And not enough time to do it. But I'll figure it out. So, with that, obviously, hope you liked Horde Night. Kind of less commentary. It was kind of a uh, mix between uh, being good and bad. But damn, were they spawning quick. Jesus. So, if you liked it, obviously, I appreciate it if you hit the like button. Uh, I'm pretty sure me and City would appreciate it a lot. Right? 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 Well, then fuck you then. If you do, would like to see more, obviously, want to keep uh, following me, I would uh, suggest hit the su subscribe button, blah, blah, blah. You know how that works. Uh, I would like to see uh, a stronger community grow from all this. Uh, like I said, I, you know, there are other titles that I would like to play. I just don't really know what to play at the moment. Uh, other than that, City disappeared, and with that, I'm disappearing too. So, hope you had uh, fun, hope everything's good, and until next time, guys, take it easy. Oh, and I forgot, I'm up to 1397. Now, the three three of those kills actually just happened right now, because I had a Future Girl, a Tweaker, and a Crawler. So, if you're curious what my final kill count was... That's where I'm at. Cause I've been trying to find out if an aim